everyone. Thanks for listening to day two of Unit 6 to Market to Market. And today, Curiosity brought some things to give us a clue about what we are going to learn about today. Are you ready? Curiosity brought with her a cash register. Where do you see a cash register at the grocery store? You see the cash register at the checkout counter. And who uses the cash register? Right, a cashier. The cashier uses a cash register to find out how much a customer has to pay for the things that he or she buys. The cashier takes money or credit cards to pay for the food. Our next clue of what she brought today is a grocery bag. Who puts the things we buy at the store into the grocery bag? You're right, the bagger. The bagger puts customers' groceries in bags for them to take home. There is a whole part of the store where people can buy fruits and vegetables. What happens after we buy our fruit? How will we get more fruit if other people go to the store and buy it? The produce worker puts out more fruit. The produce worker sorts fruits and vegetables and keeps them fresh for customers to buy. This is Curiosity's favorite kind of cereal. How do you think the cereal gets on the shelf in the store? A stalker or a stock person puts boxes and cans of food and other non-food items on the shelves. And the last thing that Curiosity brought with her today is a truck. I'm kind of confused about why Curiosity brought a truck. A truck driver delivers food and other goods from the farm or factory to the store. That's why she brought us a truck. Let's go ahead and watch a video called Big Bird Video Postcard Farmer's Market. Hi, this is Big Bird at the Green Market, Union Square, New York City. <laughs> These are my friends, Haley, Austin, and Travis. <laughs> you know why I'm here? I'm going to buy a tomato from their dad. Oh, those tomatoes look so good. Here's your tomato, Big Bird. Oh, well, here's the money. Thank you. Mmm. Did you ever wonder where all this food comes from? <laughs> well, I'll tell you. It comes from out of cans, bottles, and boxes. Right, guys? Oh, I know. Uh, it comes from the supermarkets. No! The stork brings them? No! They come from our farm! Your farm? You mean all those vegetables came from this farm? Yep! Oh! Wow, tomatoes! Hey! What are you eating? Pole beans. And so this stuff just grows here, huh? No, it didn't just grow here. We planted them. Oh, I get it. You grow food, and people and birds in the city can find some. Right. Those are especially for birds. These flowers? No, sunflower seeds. Oh. My favorite. I didn't know they came from fine flowers. What else can we eat around here? Oh, can you eat these? Us cherry tomatoes. Sure. Oh, hey, they came in their own little sack. <laughs> Are they good? Yeah. Mm. Hi, guys. How's the food? <laughs> oh. Can you eat this? Lettuce. Four. Mmm. Travis, can you eat 
Bagel, sure. Oh, can you eat this? Lucky green, sure. Mustard? I thought that came in a jar. Ooh, can you eat this? Eat this stuff, huh? Play pin. It's a carrot. Wow. Oh, can we eat this? Yeah, corn. Oh, I love corn. Oh, can you eat these? Yeah, corn. Sure. 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 Oh, one last question. What's that? When do we get to eat all this stuff? today is cashier. The cashier tells you how much the things you buy cost and takes your money when you pay. Cashier. The cashier is someone who works in a store. The cashier is the person you give your money to when you buy something. The elephant is giving the cashier at the food market money to pay for all the groceries, mostly peanuts, he is buying. Let's take a look at our daily message. Let's listen for the, our wonderful word cashier. There are many different jobs in a grocery store. Did you hear our wonderful word cashier in our message today? Listen one more time. There are many different jobs in a grocery store. Is our wonderful word in our message today? It is not. Let's see if we can remember what our letter of the week is. What is this letter? If you said B, you are right. And the sound that the letter B makes is B, B, B. Go ahead and make that sound. Let's go ahead and look at our daily message to see if we can find any letter Bs in our message. Are you ready? Let's look at the word there. Are there any bees in the word there? No. How about in the word are? Any bees? No. Let's look in the word many. Any bees? No. How about in the word different? <laughs> Any bees in the word different? No. Let's look at the word jobs. I spot a bee. Excellent work. Let's look in the word in. No. How about in the word a? No. How about in the word grocery? No. How about in the word store? Nope. There is only one B in our message today. Let's go over, go over a couple more words that start with the letter B. B, boat, b. Boat. B, bird, b. Bird. B, big, B. Big. Excellent work. Let's go ahead and watch our video called Telly, Oscar, and the letter B. Telly Monster here to show you the letter of the day. The letter B. 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 <laughs> beat it, will you? Uh, oh, uh, that's right, Oscar. A uh, uh, beat starts with the letter B. <laughs> yeah. Say bye-bye.
excuse your face, because you're crowding my trash can. Wow! Bye-bye starts with a letter B, too! You really do know your B words, Oscar! <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Enough already! And blah, blah, blah starts with B! Would you stop bothering me? Bother? Bother starts with B. Got any more B words? We're like a B team, Oscar. Come up with B words for all of our friends out there. If you won't beat it, I will. Bless. Bless also starts with the letter B. <laughs> Oscar. Oscar. Go away. Oscar. Uh, more B words, please. Oscar. Let's go over our rhyme, to market, to market. To market, to market, to buy a fat pig. Home again, home again, jiggity jig. To market, to market, to buy a fat hog. Home again, home again, jiggity jog. To have a successful and happy classroom, we need to work together. Working together means doing something with another person. For example, trying to help each other complete a task. At home, you might work together with your mom or dad to do laundry or clean the dishes. Or maybe you work with your brother or sister to set the dinner table, finish a puzzle, or to build a fort. When you play soccer with a friend, you work together to kick the ball and score the goal. Playing, helping, and sharing are all ways that we work together. Today, Trilly is going to tell us what he does when he wants to join in and play. The first thing that Trilly does is he says, hello. The next thing Trilly does is watch his friends and ask a question. For example, he might say, what are you doing? The last thing that Trilly does is ask to play. Can I play with you? If you do these three things, it will give you the chance to work together. Let's go ahead and look at our math moments. We're going to be counting with curiosity from 1 to 17. It's time to count. Let's count to number 17. Ready? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Good job. Today, Curiosity wants to do some more measuring with us. She brought more paper plates for us to use to measure our, to measure our line. These plates are different from yesterday's. Yesterday's, they were a circle, and today, these are a square. Now let's count and see how many square plates it takes to fill up our line. One, two, four, five. How many square plates did it take to fill our line? We measured five plates for how long our line was. Let's count again. Ready? One, two, three, four, Five. Five plates. Let's go ahead and watch the video called Song. Measure, yeah, measure. Measure, yeah, measure. I never thought that I could ever find out Just how big a jumbo shrimp could be But now I'm certain I don't have a doubt Wanna know the size I hold the key? Just how long for our tongue? Just then can tell you it all. Cause he's got the right tool. Now in the measure see. I will measure, I'll measure. Use your eyes. 
Station measuring is a cinch. I will measure, I'll measure. This shrimp is one foot and one inch. Measure, measure, I'll measure. I never thought that I would ever tell you just how much an elephant weighs. But now I hold the secret and you know it's true. If you want to know the way I will make. Grocery store, restaurant, food packaging plant, and build a store. I think today I will be going to the restaurant. What will you pick today for your plan and play? Thanks for listening to day two of Unit 6 to Market to Market. Stay tuned for day three. Bye!